Hare Krishna, everybody. Всем Hare Krishna, добрый день. Could you please check and see if there's water in my glass on the table? We hope that everybody has had a good day. We've had a wonderful day today. As I mentioned this morning, it is um, Indra Duna Maharaj's birthday. And um, we haven't been meeting up during our lockdown. He lives about 20 meters away. And sometimes I go and I tap on his window and he opens his window and we say hello. We've both basically been on our properties since um, March 17th when we came back from Rishikesh. But today Maharaj came over to celebrate his birthday. And we had Mahavan take a few photos of us old folks together. Maharaj and I have been friends for 41 years now. And uh, also Danishta sent over a, um, a very wonderful chocolate, uh, chocolate pie that was made by Chanchalakshi. И также Даниста прислала чудесный шоколадный пирог, приготовленный Чанчалакши. And a mango milkshake. И также молочный манговый коктейль. And some very delicious samosas and chutney. И также вкусные самосы и чатни. So Maharaj and I feasted in a way that we have not feasted since last November. И мы с Махараджем пировали так, как мы не пировали с ноября. Uh, six months ago, we both decided that we were going to go on a health program to try to uh, help ourselves. Uh, and uh, we've both been doing pretty good and we've been pretty faithful. But today we enjoyed like boys. So once again, happy birthday to Indra Dumna Swami. He is a great testimony of Guru Nishta. Uh, a totality of firm faith in the order of his spiritual master, Srila Prabhupada. Абсолютным примером полной веры в наставление своего духовного учителя Шрилы Прабхупады. 51 years engaged in practicing sadhana and distributing Krishna consciousness. 51 год он занят практикой саданы и распространением сознания Кришны. And both he does in an exemplary way. И то и другое он делает в исключительном, исключительном образом. He preaches widely. And he has really, uh, well, everybody knows that he conducts the most wonderful festivals. And uh, yeah, the most wonderful festivals. And he has really sort of grasped this internet, internet technology and he preaches to hundreds and thousands of people through the internet. He says that the instruction that he received from Srila Prabhupada 
uh, when he was young was preach boldly and have faith in the holy name. Uh, он говорит, что наставление, которое он получил в молодости от Шила Прабхупады, это проповедуй прямо, прямолинейно и uh, верь в Святое Имя. So, wonderful, wonderful uh, life of teaching by his example. То есть это чудесная, чудесная жизнь, в, в течение которой он учит своим примером. Everybody send a lot of prayers, a lot of love to Indradung Maswami. Поэтому все, пожалуйста, посылайте множество молитв и много-много любви Индрадюм Маслами. That he lives very, very long time to continue his service to Srila Prabhupada. Чтобы он мог прожить долго-долго в своем служении Шри Прабхупаде. Okay, let us read from, continue reading from Chaitanya Bhagavat. Давайте продолжим читать Chaitanya Bhagavata. Yesterday we read the uh, amazing pastime of how uh, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu as Nimai, when he was a child, he bestowed phenomenal mercy upon a Brahmin who was fixed in his worship of Bala Gopal. Вчера мы с вами прочитали, как Нимай, то есть Господь Читания, когда он был еще ребенком, проявил um, великую милость Браману, который был сосредоточен на своем поклонении Болга Павлу. And it reminded me of that uh, statement that Krishna makes in the Bhagavad Gita. Мне это напомнило о утверждении, которое делает Кришна в Бхагавад Гите. That he'll reciprocate with us according to the way that we worship him. Он говорит, что он отвечает взаимностью на, на то, как мы ему поклоняемся. So this Brahmin for many lifetimes he had been cultivating this uh, paternal mood of loving devotional service to Krishna. И этот Брахман на протяжении многих жизней он культивировал родительское настроение любви в отношении к Кришне. On the transcendental platform, we have a life which is full of activity. На трансцендентном уровне у нас есть жизнь, исполненная разнообразной деятельностью. We have a life of emotion and relationship and love. У нас есть жизнь, которая включает в себя эмоции, взаимоотношения и любовь. Now this is quite to the contrary of philosophers who wish to say that we are all one with an impersonal absolute. И это полная противоположность тому, что говорят философы, которые заявляют, что мы едины и мы все являемся абсолютом. Or the spiritual realization culminates in uh, merging into some type of void situation. Или противоположность философии, которая говорит, что совершенство заключается в растворении в пустоте. But rather, we have relationship and very gatedness here because everything that we experience in this world is a uh, reflection of what is existing in the spiritual absolute world. Но вместо этого наша философия в том, что мы сталкиваемся с разнообразием и разнообразными отношениями здесь, в материальном мире, поскольку все это является искаженным отражением того, что есть в духовном абсолютном мире. And just like one can have a parental relationship with a child, one can have a parental relationship with the Lord. In which he'll see and understand the Lord to be his beloved son. So for many lifetimes, this uh, very elevated Brahmin had been cultivating this mood of Vatsalya Bhav. And he worshipped Krishna as Bala Gopal. Meaning just as a little boy. So he went to the home of Jagannath Mishra. He cooked. He offered the Balgopal. And the little Nimai came and ate the offering. And he did it three times. And everybody was upset. And he told the Brahmin, he said, You are calling me to eat. When I come to eat, why are you upset? 
И он тогда сказал Браману, ты же зовешь меня и кушать. Почему же ты расстраиваешься, когда я прихожу и ем? И then after the Brahman doing this three times, then the Lord revealed a very phenomenal form to the Brahman. И затем, когда это произошло третий раз, Господь явил поразительную форму Браману. It was an eight-arm form. Это была восьмирукая форма. He had four arms of Vishnu. Четыре руки Вишну. And he had two arms. One of those arms was holding a pot of butter, and the other hand was eating. And the other two hands were playing flute. And he told the Brahmin something phenomenal. He said, he said, in one of your previous lives, Он сказал, в одной из своих прошлых жизней ты пришел в дом Нанды Махараджа во Вриндаване. И там получил мой даршан. И я сказал тебе, что когда я приду в этот мир, в этой лиле ты вновь меня увидишь. Ты что, не помнишь? And he said, in this lifetime, I have come here to uh, spread devotional service through the congregational chanting of the holy names. But none of, the, none, of them, excuse me, none of my family members, none of them can understand and they don't know that I'm the Supreme Person. Но никто из членов моей семьи не, не знает и не понимает, что я являюсь Верховной Личностью. So you must keep this a secret. Поэтому ты должен хранить эту тайну. And if you tell anyone, и если ты кому-то расскажешь, then I will terminate your residence in this world. тогда я прекращу твое существование в этом мире. And uh, so the Brahmin, he didn't tell anyone. Поэтому Браман никому ничего не рассказал. But after that he stayed in the Navadvip area. Но после этого он остался в Навадвипе. And he would beg alms here and there. И он собирал подарения здесь и там. But daily he would come to the house of Jagannath Mishra so he could have darshan of his Lord. Но каждый день он приходил в дом Джаганатхи Миши, чтобы получить даршан своего Господа. And so now we're going to read about the Lord beginning his studies. И теперь мы почитаем о том, как Господь начинает свое обучение. And the mischief that he performed as a child. И также хулиганские поступки, которые он совершал, будучи ребенком. And we will begin by offering obeisances to Shri Prabhupada and to Shri Bhakti Siddhanta. И начнем, предложив поклоны Shri Prabhupada и Shri Bhakti Siddhanta. Nama Om Vishnu Padaya Krishna Prasthaya Bhutale Shri Mate Bhakti Vedanta Swamini Tinamane Namaste Saraswati Devi Gorvani Vicharane Narisha Sunivadi Vastuta Devi Tarane Jai Shri Krishna Nama Om Vishnu Padaya Krishna Prasthaya Bhutale Srimati Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Iti Namane Vancha Kalpata Rubyas Chakri Pasindabe Vyacha Patitanan Pavane Vyo Vaishnava Vyo Nama Onamaha Jai Shri Krishna Chaitanya Prabhunatanam Dashi Dvaiti Gadar Harshi Vasadi Gaur Bhakti Vrinda Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare Hare In this way, Gauranga, who is non-different from Gopal, enjoyed his pastimes. Таким образом, Гауранга, который не отличен от Гопала, and very soon the time came for the Lord to begin reading and writing. On an auspicious time, on an auspicious day, Jagannath Mishra performed the ceremony for his son to begin his education. И в благоприятное время, в благоприятный день Джаганат Хамиша совершил церемонию uh, для того, чтобы его сын начал образование. Then, after a few days, all the family friends came to observe the ceremony 
of the child's ear piercing. Затем, спустя несколько дней, все друзья семьи пришли, чтобы uh, присутствовать на церемонии прокалывания ушей. And the shaving of his head, leaving only a sika. И бритья головы, оставляя одну лишь только шику. Hmm. Here, Shila Bhaktisiddhanta says, Shila Bhaktisiddhanta здесь объясняет, The piercing of the ears is part of the Chuda Karana Samskar. Прокалывание ушей это часть чуда чуда карана санскара. It marks the beginning of hearing the Vedic literature. Оно uh, обозначает начало или uh, оно означает, что человек способ, нач, uh, становится способен слушать рассказы, связанные с абсолютной истиной, и отказ от слушания рассказов не связан с Господом. That's, that's a nice understanding of this ear piercing. Это хорошее понимание, правильное понимание прокалывания ушей. It means it's, it marks the time when you become eligible for hearing the Vedic literature and understanding the absolute truth. Это знак, как бы отме... эта церемония отмечает, что теперь у человека есть возможность слушать физические произведения и осознавать абсолютную истину. Not just a matter of fashion or style. И это не просто какой-то вопрос моды или стиля. But it means dedication of the ears for hearing exclusively about Krishna. Это значит, что человек посвящает свой слух исключительно слушанию о Кришне. Chuda Karana is one of the ten samskars or reformatory ceremonies. Chuda Karana это одна из десяти samskar или преобразовательных церемоний. In this ceremony, the child's head is shaved, leaving only a sika. В, в этой церемонии э, голову ребенка бреют, оставляя одну лишь только шику. The ceremony previous, previously was known as Bidagni Shika. And later, it became known as Sri Chaitanya Shika, Shiksha. Эта церемония ранее была известна как Vidagni Shika, а позже она стала известна как Sri Chaitanya Shiksha. Okay. The Lord would write the letters of the alphabet after seeing them only once. Господь мог писать буквы алфавита, увидев их всего однажды. Everybody was astonished to see this. I have one wonderful disciple. He is super extraordinary, extraordinary in his devotional service and in his intellect. And he came to live in Vrindavan Oh goodness, he came about, he came about 1993 to live here, 93-94. He was only a boy about 17 years old. And uh, he said, Guru Maharaj, what would you like for me to do here? И он спросил Гуру Махараш, чем бы вы хотели, чтобы я занимался? Like я сказал, хочу, чтобы ты выучил санскрит. И в те времена в Искон были хорошие учителя санскрита. So I said, you please go to one of those prabhus. И я сказал, пожалуйста, отправляйся к одному из этих прабу. And you take him some fruit and some flowers. Принеси ему фрукты и uh, цветы. Offer obeisances. Предложи поклоны. And request that they will teach you Sanskrit. И скажи, что ты хотел бы изучать санскрит. So he approached one of the teachers. И он обратился к одному из учителей. And the teacher wanted to test him. И учитель хотел его проверить. So the teacher said, do you know Hindi? Учитель спросил у него, ты знаешь хинди? And my disciple said no. И мой ученик сказал нет. And he said, how will I teach you Sanskrit if you don't know Hindi? So this was the test that the teacher gave my disciple. He said, well, you go home tonight. 
Сегодня, когда вечером пойдешь домой, and come back here tomorrow morning. Возвращайся сюда завтра утром. And if you can write the entire Hindi alphabet by tomorrow morning, I will teach you Sanskrit. Если завтра утром ты сможешь написать весь алфавит Хинди, то я буду учить тебя Санскриту. So this young disciple, he went home. Тогда этот ученик отправился домой. And in one night, he learned to write the Hindi alphabet. And he went back the next morning and the Sanskrit teacher tested him. And he saw the great capacity that this young student had. And, and accepted him as his student. So Lord Chaitanya, he could just see you know, a letter once, he would learn it. Within two or three days, the Lord completed the study of conjunct letters. And then he began constantly writing different names of Krishna. И затем он стал постоянно писать различные святые имена Кришны. Day and night he enthusiastically wrote and read names of the Lord. День и ночь он с энтузиазмом писал и читал имена Господа. He would write Rama, Krishna, Murari, Mukunda, Vanamali. Он писал такие имена как Рама, Кришна, Мурари, Мукунда и Ванамали. I can recall two three years ago I was studying Arabic language for a short time. And when I got some understanding of how to write, I would sit and I would write different names of Krishna. The most fortunate persons of Nadia saw the Lord of Vaikuntha study with other young boys. Самые удачливые люди Надии, жители Надии, видели, как Господь Вайкунтхи обучается вместе с другими мальчиками. The Lord would very sweetly recite the Bengali alphabet. Очень сладким образом Господь повторял бенгальский алфавит. Ka, ka, ga, ga. And, and everybody who heard him, they were captivated. Ka, ka, ga, ga. И любой, кто его слышал, был очарован. Sri Gorsundar was always performing very wonderful pastimes. He would demand things that were impossible to obtain. If he saw a bird flying in the sky, he would desire to have it. And if it was not given to him, he would cry and he would roll in the dust. И когда ее ему не давали, он плакал и валялся в земле. Some, sometimes he would demand the moon and the stars in the sky. Иногда он требовал луну и звезды с неба. And when they didn't give to him, he would just cry and move his arms and legs. И когда их ему не давали, он начинал плакать и э, шевелить руками и ногами. Every tried, everybody tried to pacify the child. Все пытались успокоить ребенка. But Vishwambar did not give up and he'd say, give me, give me, give me. But there was one sure remedy. Is when he would hear the chanting of Hari Hari, he would stop crying. And when everyone would clap their hands and chant the names of Hari, the Lord would become, would become pacified and give up all restlessness. I can recall one time seeing one Lila of Valgopal. Uh, he was uh, demanding from Jasoda that Jasoda would give him the moon. Он просил, требовал от Ямуны, от Ишоды, чтобы та дала ему луну. And he was crying and crying and crying. И он плакал и плакал и плакал. And uh, his friend Madhumangal came. И пришел его друг Madhumangal. 
And Marumanga said, well, I can give you the moon. Do you want? And, you know, Krishna said, yes, of course. Well, then what he did is he took a plate and he put water in it. And he showed the reflection of the moon in the plate. And Krishna still cried. As everyone chanted the names of Hari in order to please the child, the house of Jagannath Mishra appeared just like Vaikuntha. Тогда как все воспевались эти имена Хари для удовлетворения ребенка, дом Джаганат Хамиши превратился в трансцендентную обитель Вайкунти. But one day, in spite of chanting the holy names of Hari, the child did not stop crying. Но однажды, несмотря на то, что все воспевали имена Хари, ребенок не перестал плакать. And everybody in the house was speaking to him. И все в доме с ним говорили. Listen, dear Nimai, come, come and dance. Послушай-ка, Нимай, дорогой, давай потанцуем. Dance beautifully while we chant the holy names of Hari. Танцуй красиво, пока мы поем все эти имена Хари. But Nimai wasn't listening to them, and he continued to cry. Но Господь Нимай их не слушал и не продолжал плакать. And then they ask him, my dear child, why are you still crying? И тогда они стали его спрашивать, дорогой дитя, ты почему плачешь? What do you want? We'll bring it for you here in a minute. Что же ты хочешь? Мы принесем тебе это сейчас же. But dear child, stop crying. Но дорогой ребенок, дитя, дорогое, пожалуйста, перестань плакать. And the Lord replied. Тогда Господь ответил. If you want to save my life, then very quickly go to the house of two Brahmins. Если вы хотите спасти мою жизнь, тогда скорее идите в дом двух браманов. Джагадиш и Хиранья являются, оба они являются великими преданными. И я хочу кое-чего от них. Сегодня Икадыши, поэтому оба они постятся. But they have prepared varieties of food stuff for Lord Vishnu. Just one moment. Ah. They are fasting, but they provide, but they have made very nice food stuff for Lord Vishnu. If I could eat their offering, I would be cured, and I would be able to walk. Если я съем это подношение, то я буду исцелен и смогу опять ходить. Hearing this impossible proposal, Mother Sachi said, Mother Sachi lamented. You are requesting something that is not sanctioned in the Vedas or in ordinary dealings. Everybody laughed on hearing the child's demand. Все рассмеялись, услышав требования ребенка. But they said, all right, we'll give you. Но, но при этом сказали, ладно, мы тебе это дадим. But please stop crying. Но, пожалуйста, перестань плакать. Those two Brahmins were great Vaishnavs and dear most friends of Jagannath Mishra. Эти два Брамана были великими Вайшнавами и дорогими друзьями Джаганат Мишра. And when those first class Brahmins heard the request of the child, they became fully satisfied. И когда эти два первоклассных брамана услышали просьбу ребенка, они испытали полное удовлетворение. And the two Brahmins, they replied, эти два брамана ответили, This is an amazing demand. Это удивительное требование. We have never heard of such an intelligent child. Мы никогда не слышали о таком разумном ребенке. How did he know that today is Ekadashi? How did he know that we have prepared all kinds of foodstuffs for the Lord? We can understand that since this child is so attractive, Gopal must have manifest inside of his body. Lord Narayan himself performs pastimes through the body of this child. Господь Нарайана, сам Господь Нарайана являет свои игры через тело этого ребенка. And sitting in his heart, Lord Narayan makes him speak. И сидя в его сердце, Нарайана заставляет его говорить. And thinking like this, the two Brahmins very happily brought the various offerings and gave them to Nimai. И думая таким образом, эти двое Браманов принесли разнообразные подношения и с радостью отдали их Нимай. 
So he's still just a very little boy, just beginning his school. And he comes up with a request like this on the Ekadashi day. The two Brahmins came to the home of Jagannath Mishra. They brought those palatable foodstuffs. And they said, Dear child, please eat these foodstuffs. Our desire to serve Krishna is fulfilled today. When one is blessed by Krishna, he receives the intelligence to engage in devotional service. And unless one is a servant of the Lord, he cannot have such intelligence. That's a very nice statement. When one is blessed by Krishna, he receives the intelligence by which to engage in devotional service. And in the Gita, Krishna says that I give them the intelligence by which they can engage in my worship. That I, I give them knowledge from within the heart. That he lights the lamp of knowledge that's within the heart. So we should always faithfully engage in Krishna's devotional service. And Krishna will always give us the intelligence by which we can come to know him. And unless you're a devotee, you won't get that type of intelligence. Krishna will give you intelligence to engage in sense gratification. Krishna will give you intelligence to forget him. Krishna will give you intelligence to try to attain some type of liberation. But unless you give your soul and devotion, Krishna will not give you the intelligence by which you can come to him. So we should be sure that this blessing is going to come from Krishna. But we should also be sure that we should faithfully keep ourselves engaged in bhakti as we have learned from our predecessor Acharyas. Without performing devotional service, a person cannot understand Lord Chaitanya. From whose pores innumerable universes emanate. Let's read the last purport. This is Srila Bhakti Siddhanta. Krishna, is the super, Krishna as the super soul appears in the hearts of the living entities and as the instructing spiritual master. Excuse me. Krishna appears as the super soul within the heart of the living entities. As the instructing spiritual master from within. <coughs> to inspire one to serve the Supreme Lord. The living entities prove their intelligence by accepting that mercy of the Lord. No one other than the eternal servant of the Supreme Lord can ever exhibit such a service attitude. Only one who is favored by the Lord 
can understand him. Только тот, кто получил благосклонность Господа, может постичь его. Does this go in the line of what you were discussing last night? Yeah. yeah. Only one who is favored by the mercy of the Lord can understand him. Только тот, кто получил благосклонность Господа, может постичь его. So, for that reason, we should always engage in the activities to attract the favor of Krishna. По этой причине нам нужно постоянно быть занятыми деятельностью, которая привлекает благосклонность Кришны. We should read and we should understand. Нам следует читать и пытаться понимать. Accept what is favorable, reject what is unfavorable. Принимать благоприятное, отвергать неблагоприятное. Understand that Krishna is our maintainer, Krishna is our protector. Осознавать, что Кришна нас поддерживает и защищает. Have full humility as we engage in devotional service. И проявлять полное смирение, занимаясь преданным служением. Always cultivate the feeling, I want to give my soul to Krishna. Всегда культивировать это чувство, я хочу вручить свою душу Кришне. And with such a devotional mentality, Krishna will reciprocate with us. И в таком настроении преданности, в таком сознании преданности Кришна будет отвечать нам взаимностью. And we become favored by Krishna, and then Tesham Satati Yuktanam Bhajatam Pritipur become Didami Buddhi Yogam Tam. Then he gives us the knowledge. И тогда, получив благословность Кришны, Он даст нам разум. Without performing devotional service, one cannot understand Lord Chaitanya. Не занимаясь преданным служением, никто не может постичь Господа Чайтанья. From whose hair pores innumerable universes emanate. Из чьих пор исходят бесчисленные вселенные. The devotional service of Sri Chaitanya Dev is never awakened by the material endeavors of the living entity. Преданное служение Шри Чайтанья Деву никогда не пробуждается посредством материальных усилий живого существа. Only those who have awakened their devotional service, which is the activity of the soul, can understand Sri Chaitanya Dev. Только те, кто пробудили свое преданное служение, которое является деятельностью души, могут постичь Шри Чайтанья Дева. So we should hear faithfully from our spiritual masters. Нам нужно с верой слушать от наших духовных учителей. Hear from sadhus. Слушать саду. Hear from shastra. Слушать шастру. How to awaken the spirit of unmotivated devotional service. Как же пробудить дух без при... And remember that that's our hope. What's the verse? Subai pumsam paro dharmo yato bhaktir adhoksaje ahai tuki akriti yata. Unmotivated devotional service. We should simply want bhakti for the sake of bhakti. We want bhakti for the sake of bhakti. That same Lord performed his pastimes as a young Brahmin child. Этот тот же самый Господь являл свои игры как маленький ребенок Брамана. And the Lord's eternal servants see those pastimes to the full satisfaction of their eyes. И вечные слуги Господа созерцали эти игры до полного удовлетворения своих глаз. Premanjana Churita Bhakti Vilochanaina Shantak Vidayashu Vilokayanti Yam Shamasundara Machinchu Guna Sorupam Govinda Madi Purusham Tamaham Bajami Eyes of Devotion Anointed with the Ointment of Love. Then when we have these eyes of devotion, we can see Krishna everywhere. Обладая этими uh, глазами преданности, мы можем видеть Кришну повсюду. I've mentioned before how I was listening to the uh, morning walk recording of Srila Prabhupada. Я упоминал, как я слушал запись утренней прогулки со Шрила Прабхупадой. And Prabhupada wasn't saying too much. И Шрила Прабхупада особо немного не говорил. And you could hear him walking and you could hear his cane tapping the ground. 
И им можно было слышать, как он идет и постукивает свои э, трости по земле. And Prabhupada is making this point. И Прабхупада сделал это утверждение. Only with eyes of love can we see Krishna. Только глазами любви мы можем увидеть Кришну. We have to have eyes of devotion covered with the ointment of love. У нас должны быть глаза преданности, умощенные бальзамом любви. So one of my god brothers was there who's an actor and he's very dramatic. И вот у меня один из моих духовных братьев, который является актером, он очень драматичный. And he sort of just very loudly exclaimed. И он uh, очень громко заявил. О Шила Прабхупад, I do not have devotional eyes. О Шила Прабхупад, у меня нет глаз преданности. I have only material eyes. У меня только материальные глаза. No response from Prabhupada. И никакого ответа от Прабхупада не было. And you could hear Prabhupada's cane tapping. And some minutes later, my god brother again, he very loudly said, But Prabhupada, I do not have eyes of love. I have only material eyes. No response from Srila Prabhupada. And then continued walking. And then, but Prabhupada, I do not have eyes of love to see Krishna. No Prabhupada, у меня нет глаз любви, чтобы видеть Кришну. And then Prabhupada spoke to him. Said, then I will rip out your eyes, and I will give you eyes of love by which you can see Krishna. Тогда я вырву твои глаза и дам тебе глаза, с помощью которых ты увидишь Кришну. Прабхат gave him a very dramatic response also. То есть Шрила Прабхат ответил ему тоже очень драматично. The Lord was very satisfied to receive the prasadam of Hiranyan Jagadish. Господь был очень удовлетворен получить просад, получив просад от Хирани Джагадиши. And he ate just a little bit of each item. И он съел понемножку от каждого блюда. The Lord very joyfully ate the foodstuffs that had been offered by his servants. Очень радостно Господь съел пищу, предложенную его преданными слугами. Thus, by his own will, his intense craving was satisfied. Таким образом, по его собственной воле, его сильное желание было удовлетворено. Everyone present happily chanted the names of Hari as the Lord ate and danced to the chanting of the holy names. Все присутствующие с радостью воспевали имена Хари, как, тогда как Господь ел и танцевал под это воспевание святых имен. Some of the prasad fell on the floor. Какой-то прасад упал на пол. And some of the prasad fell on other people who were present there. А какой-то прасад попал на людей присутствующих. In this way, Tridas Rai performed his pastimes. Таким образом, Тридаша Рай совершал свои деяния. Well, this is a nice name, but he's given to Lord Chaitanya. Это чудесное имя, данное Господу Читанию. Тридаша Рай. Тридаша Рай. So let's see what it means. Tridas Rai refers to one who destroys the living entities' threefold miseries, which are miseries inflicted by the body and mind, miseries inflicted by other living entities, and miseries, miseries inflicted by natural disturbance. Second meaning of Tridasarai. The Lord of those who under the influence of birth, death, disease, birth, excuse me, of birth, existence, or death, and childhood, youth, or old age. Господь тех, кто находится под влиянием рождения, существования или смерти, или uh, детства, юности и старости. So he is the Lord of threes. То есть он Господь трех. And the first three is the threefold miseries. И первые три это тройственные страдания. And second three is those who are under the influence of birth, existence, and death. Вторые три это те, кто находится под влиянием рождения, существования и смерти. 
The next is he is the Lord of 33 demigods. The 12 Adityas. The 11 Rudras. The 8 Vas Vasus. And the 2 Vishvadevas. He is Gaur Vishnu, the Lord of all Lords. A lot of nice names here. Tridas Roy and, and Gaur Vishnu. That same Lord who is glorified in the Vedas and Puranas thus played in the courtyard of Mother Sachi. Этот самый Господь, который прославляется в Ведах и Пуранах, таким образом играл во дворе матери Шачи. Lord Vishwambar drowned in the mood of a restless child. Господь Вишвамбара утонул в настроении непоседливого ребенка. And he always sported with the other young Brahmin boys. И он постоянно играл, соревновался с другими молодыми мальчиками Браманов. Когда Господь отправлялся учить, обучаться <coughs> в разные места со своими друзьями, никто не мог его контролировать. Когда бы Господь не встречал каких-то новых ребят, он постоянно издевался над ним. And when the other boys would retaliate, then a quarrel would happen. И когда мальчики начинали возражать, начиналась ссора. No. But by the strength of the Lord, he and his friends would always win such quarrels. И благодаря силе Господа он и его друзья всегда выигрывали эти ссоры. And the other boys would leave defeated. И, и другие э, мальчики покидали, уходили с поражением. Lord Chaitanya would sometimes become covered with gray from dust. Иногда Господь Чайтанья становился серый от того, что его покрывала пыль. And he would be covered with drops of ink from his pen. И его покрывали капли чернил из его ручки. And thus he appeared very beautiful. И тогда он выглядел очень красиво. At noon, after their studies, the Lord and his friends would joyfully go and bathe in the Ganga. В полдень после, после учебы Господь с друзьями радостно отправлялся на Гангу омыться. So, he would play as a child, cover his body with dust, and then while studying, he'd get ink all over himself. То есть он... Будучи ребенком, игрался, из-за этого его тело покрывалось пылью, а во время учебы капельки чернил падали. И затем он с друзьями отправлялся играть на гангу. Я помню, в 1976 я в первый раз отправился в Майпур. И каждый день мы ходили на гангу. All the devotees would go to the Ganga. Все преданные ходили на гангу. And we would play and we would dive in the Ganga. И мы играли, ныряли в гангу. And I can recall in one area Satsarup Maharaj would sit down and give class and another area Ridayananda Maharaj would sit down and give class. Я помню, что в одном месте Satsarup Maharaj садился, давал лекцию, в другом месте Ridayananda Maharaj садился, давал лекцию. And we would always try to find the highest like uh, land above the Ganga so that we would run and we would dive into the Ganga. And, uh, and you had to really jump out to make sure that you would miss the mud. <laughs> Нужно было как следует разбежаться и прыгнуть, чтобы убедиться, что ты в землю не воткнешься. Nice Я помню, был один чудесный преданный. Он был фантастическим распространителем. И Шрила Прабхупада назвал его воплощением распространения книг. И вот однажды он разбежался, чтобы нырнуть в Гангу. И он uh, не нырнул достаточно далеко. И он нырнул вот так вот вниз. И голова у него застряла в 
<laughs> and we just, everybody saw his feet coming up. <laughs> and we said, whoops, the incarnation is having a problem. Oops, воплощение похоже проблемы. We went down and we pulled him out. <laughs> I also remember that year, one of my nice, such nice god brother from Montreal. His name is Gokulananda. Such a sweet devotee. And we came here to Vrindavan. And he decided to dive off Keshi Ghat into the Jamuna one day. And he failed to realize the water was only about two feet deep. And I think he broke his neck. But fortunately, by the grace of Krishna and by the grace of Jamuna, he had no long-lasting problems. So I guess when boys get around the Jamuna or the Ganga, they always like to play. Okay. Vishwambar and his friends eagerly entered the Ganga. Wherein they enjoyed splashing water on each other. Who can describe the opulence of Nabadvip? Innumerable people took bath at one of the bathing gods. Hmm. Okay. I am unable to say how many saints, ascetic, householders, sannyasis, and children came there to take their bath. Я не могу сказать, сколько святых, аскетов, домохозяев, саньяси и детей пришли туда, чтобы принять омовение. As the Lord swam in the Ganga with his associates, когда Господь плавал в Ганге со своими приятелями, sometimes he would dive under the surface and sometimes he would float. Иногда он нырял вглубь, а иногда он плавал на поверхности. And this way he would enjoy various water sports. I can recall one time going to <coughs> going to Mayapur and somehow or other I was traveling with His Holiness Jai Pataka Swami Maharaj. Long time ago. And maybe we were Maybe we were more than a kilometer before coming to Mayapur Temple. And he said, let's swim down river till we get to Mayapur. So we just stopped, he stopped the vehicle. We got out, we walked through the field. And we just dove in the Ganga. And then we just floated downstream till we came to Mayapur. And I think that Maharaj, until he had his stroke, he was always swimming in the Ganga. And I can recall going uh, on the Navadip Parikram also, when we'd go to Godrum Dweep, <coughs> and go to Bhakti Manod's house. Many times we would dive in the Ganga there, and we'd, and, excuse me, dive in the uh, Jalangi, and we would swim down to Surabi Kunj. While engaged in water sports, Lord Gorsundar would splash water with his feet on those who were nearby. Uh, uh, 
Занимаясь этими водными играми, Господь Гарасундра плескал воду своими стопами на окружающих. So he very cleverly goes swimming by people. То есть он по хитрым подплывал человеку. Sometimes he'd have Brahmins standing there chanting their Gayatri. Иногда Брахманы там стояли, повторяли Gayatri. And he'd just kick his feet on the water and splash feet, splash water in their face. И он брал свои стопы и начинал брызгать водой и прям в лицо. People would forbid him from doing this. Люди запрещали ему делать это. But he would just ignore them. And they would not be able to catch him. And the Lord would compel everyone to bathe again and again by touching them. And he'd like take his mouth full of water and, and he would spit it on them. <laughs> That's pretty unique. You know, just when everything is starting to relax. You know, everybody's just getting ready to, to leave. And Lord Chaitanya, in order to get things moving again, just as a boy, just take, take a big mouthful of water and go up to somebody and go, <laughs> blow it in their face. <laughs> Being unable to restrain him, the Brahmins approached his father to complain about this boy's behavior. The Brahmins would say, Dear Jagannath Mishra, Please hear about the misdeeds that your son is performing every day at the Ganga. Because of his misdeeds, we're unable to take our bath properly. He splashes water on me. He disturbs my meditation. Your son came to me. And he said, Oh, my dear Brahman, who are you meditating on? He said, Don't you understand? In Kali Yuga, I'm directly Lord Narayan. Why don't you just meditate on me? Another person said, This boy is so naughty. He came and he stole my Shiva Lingam while I was wor worshipping. And another person said, Yes, he's so naughty. He stole my chatter while I was in the water. Then he said, Why are you unhappy? Oh, excuse me, excuse me. I, I, I missed a verse. Someone told Jagannath Mishra, I kept such nice ingredients for worshipping Vishnu. I had flowers and durba grass and boga. I had sandalwood pulp, I had the Lord's asana. All on the banks of the Ganga. And when I went to take my bath, your son sat on the Lord's asana. Your son ate the boga. Your son smeared himself with sandalwood paste. He decorated himself with the flowers. And then he looked up at me and he smiled. And he ran away. And then he said, Why are you unhappy, you Brahmin? He for whom you have arranged these ingredients has enjoyed them himself. That must have made them very upset. Especially because they were all my bodies. But you organized everything to worship the Lord. So I'm enjoying them. What's your problem? <laughs> Another person said, 
I was standing in the water chanting my Gayatri. He swam up behind me. He grabbed me by the feet and he pulled me into the water. Another person said, He always takes my flower basket. He, he always takes my clean cloth that I'm going to wear after I take my bath. Another person said, he steals my Bhagavad Gita. Then somebody complained. My son is very strong. But your son makes him cry by always splashing water in his ears. No, oh, excuse me, my son is very young. <laughs> and your son is so naughty that he comes and he splashes water in his ears and he makes my son cry. Another Brahmin complained. He comes up behind me. He climbs up on my shoulders. And then from my shoulders he dives into the water. <laughs> and he screams, I am the Lord of Mahesh. Some person said, Your son sits on the asana and he eats all my offerings. When I come out from taking, let's see, did I skip? No. When I come out from my bath, he throws sand on me. And he's surrounded by a team of mischievous boys. Sometimes he takes the men's clothes and he runs and he puts them where the women's clothes are and he brings saris back and he leaves the saris where we're supposed to put our clothes on. Иногда он берет мужскую одежду, бежит, подменяет ее на женскую, а женскую подменяет на мужскую, и, чтобы мы ее одевали. And then everybody becomes embarrassed when they're supposed to go and dress. И все потом uh, в замешательстве, когда им нужно одеваться. О, Джаганат Мишра. О, Джаганат Мишра. You are our dear friend. Ты наш дорогой друг. Therefore, we have come here to inform you of this nonsense that your son is doing every day. Every day this child remains in the water for up to six hours. Being in the water for such a long time, how will his body remain fit and healthy? And then they would complain to Sachi. Listen to what your son has done. He steals our clothes and he speaks very badly. And if we complain, he throws water on us and he begins to quarrel. By, by force, he just scatters all the fruits and flowers that we, we brought for puja. And we come out from our bath, he throws sand on us. And the worst thing is he has this whole team of mischievous boys. Every day he behaves like this. Who does your son Nimai think he is? Does he think he's the son of a king or something? The, the activities of your son, these, you know, these resemble the activities that we hear of performed by the son of the king of Nanda. То, чем занимается твой сын Нимай, они, он, это в точности повторяет то, что мы слышали, чем занимается сын Нанда. He's not the son of a king, he's just the son of a Brahmin. Но он же не сын царя, он сын просто Брамана. And the girls began to, the, the girls were complaining. И также еще девочки начинают жаловаться. When we tell our parents about your son's mischief, they will surely come and quarrel with you. Когда мы... Расскажем твоим, своим родителям 
о том, как ведет в себя ваш сын, они точно придут и будут... For sure, when we tell our parents about your naughty son, they're going to come and they're going to quarrel with you. Совершенно точно, мы расскажем о хулиганстве вашего сына своим родителям, они придут и... Therefore, please control your son immediately. Поэтому немедленно приструните своего сына. Because these type of activities are not allowed in Nadia. Поскольку такая деятельность не разрешена в Nadia. And on hearing these complaints, the Lord's mother smiled. Услышав эти жалобы, мать Господа улыбнулась. She would embrace the young girls. Она обняла девочек. And sweetly speak to them. И обратилась к ним сладким. When Nimai returns today, I will tie him up and beat him with a stick. And then he won't disturb you again. After that, all the girls went and they took dust from Sachi Devi's feet. And they went to take their bath. Yet, in spite of Nimai's mischief, И, тем не менее, несмотря на все проделки Немая, Ultimately, everybody felt satisfied. в конце концов, все чувствовали полное удовлетворение. Okay, we're going to stop here today. На этом на сегодня закончим. Thank you all very much. Спасибо вам всем большое. May you all uh, have remembrance of, of child Немай and his naughty behavior. Uh, пусть... У вас всегда будет возможность помнить о ребенке Немае и его хулиганских поступках. And remembering his uh, хулиганский behavior, may your heart be satisfied. <laughs> Помни о его хулиганских проделках, пусть ваше сердце всегда будет удовлетворено. Everybody uh, stay safe. Uh, берегите себя. If possible, stay inside. Если возможно, оставайтесь дома. Keep washing those hands. Продолжайте мыть свои руки. Keep social distancing. Продолжайте соблюдать социальное дистанцирование. Please con continue to send prayers for Lord Krishna and for Gopi Janabalava. Пожалуйста, продолжайте молиться за Lord Krishna и Gopi Janabalava. And everybody send love and prayers to Indradhyumna Swami on his 71st birthday. И также пошлите свои молитвы и любовь. Thank you very much. We're going to be having Kirtan again tomorrow at 7 a.m. Could you all do a favor for me? Could you sort of spread the information in your social networks that uh, we're going to be having Kirtan? So that we can increase the number of viewers that will be there. So everybody can relish Akinshana and Devashekar and, and the Holy Name. So 7 a.m. Kirtan. For us, it's very, very relishable in the morning. Just coming together and swimming in the nectar of the Holy Name. And, uh, yeah, the nectar of the Holy Name, and it's still it's very pleasant that time in the morning. We just have the fan zone, the windows open, we don't need AC. And the holy names are so relishable. They're truly the grace of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Okay, thank you all very much. Now we'll give you darshan of the deities. Hare Krishna, Srila Prabhupada, Ki Jai. Hare Krishna, here's the altar today. We're still hanging the jasmine garlands. And here is 
Oh, Champakalata just sent a, sent a message, and he said that Law Krishna has gone to critical position in the hospital. Champakalata только что пришло сообщение, что Лао Кришна в критическом состоянии в больнице. Everybody, please say prayers to Radhe Sham and Lord Nishingadev for the protection of Law Krishna Prabhu. Пожалуйста, все помолитесь Радхи Шьям и Господу Нисимхадеве о защите Лао Кришна Прабху. Ситуация критическая. Ситуация критическая. Лао Кришна older, so so he is more affected by uh, what this COVID-19 does to the body. Лао Кришна он пожилой, поэтому он больше подвержен влиянию того, что делает COVID-19 тело. Everybody, please just look at Giriraj and my deities and say a prayer to them now for the protection of Law Krishna. Поэтому, пожалуйста, все посмотрите на божества и помолитесь им о защите Лао Кришны. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. Here's Giriraj today, hiding in his in his rose bed. Jai Giridaj Maharaj Ki Jai. And here is Radha Govinda today. Jai Jai Shri Radhe Shyam. Jai Radhe Sham. Yes, garlands are made by Ainagul. Ainagul. Ainagul and uh, Omkarakrita. Omkarakrita. Brindalata. Brindalata. Marina and Marina. Solanus. So, a whole wonderful team of Matajis are working to make these beautiful garlands. Law Krishna just sent a message and he said, he said, thank everyone for prayers. And I can't see more, but there's something more there. And here is Govinda today. Bhaja Radhe Govinda, Bhaja Mana Radhe Govinda, Bhaja Mana Radhe Govinda, Bhaja Mana Radhe Govinda, Bhaja Mana Radhe 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 Govinda, Bhaja Mana Radhe 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 Govinda, Tishi Radha Govinda Ki Jai. And here are Dayana Thai Gorachandra today. And here is that naughty boy who is playing in the Ganga and harassing all the Brahmins. Jai Gaura Haribo. And here is Nitai. Nitai. Jai Nitai. And Patit Pavan. Patit Pavan Jai. And here.
here is the Panchatattva. Is this Panchatattva? And these are the jasmine garlands. Such a beautiful aroma, this jasmine. Yes, Sulalita, harass those smarter Brahmins. And Srila Prabhupada. Okay, now I'm getting another message that uh, Lord Krishna Prabhu is recovering. So it seems like there was a mix-up in communication there. And that's wonderful to hear. But keep praying. Because it's always wonderful to pray for Vaishnavas. Ari Bo, Shraddha, how are you? So nice to see you. Or to see that you're here. How's your been to Saru, Prabhu? Yeah, Moksha. If you say a prayer, Person is going to get rid. Person is going to get well immediately. Hey, Moksha, I saw that your your husband received some special recognition in the news or something like that. Law Krishna just sent me a message. He said, he said, I am better, but please, everyone, please keep praying. Law Krishna, только что прислал мне сообщение что да, мне лучше, но, пожалуйста, продолжайте молиться. And, uh, and please keep praying for Gopi Janabalava. И также, пожалуйста, продолжайте молиться за Gopi Janabalava. Gopi is such a wonderful devotee, but he has, uh, his constitution is very weak. Gopi, он чудесный, преданный, но конституция у него очень слабая. And he's been sick now for at least three weeks and he's in the hospital and uh, it's very hard for him to catch some strength hey moksha give my obeisances to parashuram and vijay radhika says that saraswati is also very very sick Everybody, please say prayers for Saraswati in, in Russia. And here are those nice jasmine garlands again. They make the room so fragrant. This time of the year they make big houses of these jasmine garlands and put around all the deities in Vrindavan. Okay, thank you all very much. Remember, please share with all your friends that at 7 a.m. tomorrow we're going to be having kirtan from Brindavan. And we haven't been able to get the YouTube working yet. So everybody please uh, check in here on uh, Facebook Live. Поэтому, пожалуйста, все проверьте здесь, Facebook. Uh, live.
and uh, we'll be chanting Hare Krishna. Okay. I thank you all very much. Спасибо вам всем большое. Jai Jai Shri Radhe Shyam.